guys, Lizan here from Sparkles in the Wild. So today we are in the Bardenas Desert and I thought because uh, we don't know the difference between desert and dessert that it would be nice to do uh, a meal in the desert. I think it would be something with rice and vegetables, I don't know yet. And I will tell you everything I do as usual. So let's go! Okay, and when Lizan's cooking, I have one job, is to put the bottle of gas on the stove. So I just have to put the hose through this hole here. And the stove's ready. Okay, so I thought uh, because we are in the sun, uh, it would be nice to have something uh, fresh and with vegetables. So I'm cooking some zucchinis and eggplant and I will uh, add some um, red meat, uh, beef and also some uh, tomato sauce. And I check the temperature and it's actually right now uh, 14 degrees and <laughs> I'm not used to them, this temperature, especially when uh, I'm in winter, so it's very nice, but I need my hat to cook because I don't like the sun that much. Oh. So <laughs> I'm cooking with my hat and yeah, I'm making some zucchinis, eggplant, and I think it will be nice. So I cut all of my veggies and I think I was a little bit too optimistic because now uh, it's full uh, like more than full so I add some water uh, as you know the water will go and sit at the bottom of the, the casserole and it will help with uh, like the, the condensation and everything and it will also help uh, because all the veggies that are in the bottom won't stick and won't uh, burn so I will try to move a little bit everything around normally eggplant will um, shrink but for now I'm just gonna let everything sit for a minute and I'm gonna put this so it will keep the veggies to stay put so yeah, like one, two minutes like this and normally will help um, the veggies to shrink and I will be able to do something with it, I hope. Okay, so I need to uh, show you something in our drawer. So as you can see, we have a lot of uh, plastic bags, plastic bag for the pasta, plastic bag for the bread, uh, plastic bags inside another container. And this is because, well, we do our grocery like everybody else. But the thing is that we live on the road. Uh, we are always on the move and it's very, very difficult for us to recycle. Um, so we are looking for another solution, uh, maybe container that are reusable or another way to consume things. And of course, if you have any idea, something that you show, something that you use, please comment in the section down below. And for us, we are still thinking about it, but we will do a video about it for sure very, very soon. So stay tuned. Okay, and this is something that I very, very like because uh, in the beginning of our trip in Spain, we found uh, some spices some herbs so we have team <laughs> I don't know the English word and we also have how do you call it rosemary 
Rosemary. Rosemary. Romarin est un. So rosemary and thyme, so thyme and rosemary, and I want to add it to our um, food today. So it can be less organic than that. So as you can see the veggies uh, shrank so now I can move around and it's way easier so that's that's very good and now oh, someone tried to escape and now I'm gonna put the meat and after that I'm going to put the tomato sauce and my favorite part spices but this is for the end Okay, so I add up the meat. I'm trying to put it at the bottom of the casserole so it will cook better. I'm gonna let it sit for five minutes again. And after, tomato sauce and we eat. Okay, so it's been five minutes, so I can check everything, but it seems very, very nice. Perfect. And now I'm gonna add so it's uh, some tomato sauce. Okay. <laughs> so what I like to do is, as you can see, that there's a lot of sauce uh, left in the can, and I like to put some water in it like this and I close it, I check, I shake and up so that's it okay and there's a lot of um, it's kind of a juice it's not very good uh, I don't like it personally it's too liquid for me so I'm just gonna put everything under the sauce like this and once again I'm just gonna let it sit until it's uh, more creamy so just have to wait and after that it will be good to go oh no I forgot the spices so before I leave everything so my favorite part is adding some spice so for this one, I'm gonna add some uh, chili. I'm also gonna add some, another chili and some salt. Yeah, that sounds good. So let's do it. What about pepper? No, uh, we don't need pepper, we have chili. Okay. So, I just take some chili like this and I'm gonna cut them into the into the recipe so just like this one and another one and another one so <laughs> Jordan is supposed to like it when it's uh, spicy so I hope you like it <laughs> because I'm putting a lot of spice into this one. Oh. Some Okay, that's it. And some soap.
I just mix everything once again to make sure that it all goes everywhere and so we have the best of the best and after that ah uh, so is that ready I'm so hungry you are I hope you like it yeah I hope to do you want to taste yep sure okay Wow, that's so spicy. <laughs> what did you put in it? Nothing. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I put some chili. You like chili, right? Okay, so I think we are good now. Yes, it smells very good. So I can turn off the stove like this. And so this is Jordan's plate. I put a lot of uh, bulgur at the end of it because uh, he needs way more food than me. So. I'm gonna serve him some. Uh, I will call this recipe eggplant zucchini chili red meat, which is actually everything that I put inside of it. So it's not like a, a fancy name. Or maybe I can I can call it like um, Bardenas Desert. <laughs> I don't know why I took this accent. I'm sorry. Okay. Anyway, so. That's it, and I'm just gonna add some uh, coriander into my plate. Jordan doesn't like it, so no coriander for Jordan. Cut it like this, and okay, so I think we're good and we can eat now. So how is it? Very nice. The best meal you ever had? I think so, yeah. <laughs> yes, and the view is not bad as well. Wow, it's a good view. Bon appétit. Bon appétit. So that's it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you want to follow my adventure, you can subscribe to this channel. You can also check my Instagram account, my Facebook page and my merch store. Thank you guys for watching and see you soon. <laughs>